guys, so um, long time no see, I'm sorry, I was on vacation, and by the way, my eyes are swollen, so I'm kind of, I was kind of like debating whether I should make this video or not, but I'm like, screw it, I'm just gonna make it because I love my YouTubers. <laughs> yeah, anyways, um, yeah, it's back to school time if you didn't know, just go to Walmart, they have their back to school sale already, I hate Walmart because they have like the earliest back to school sale. I go there in like July, end of July, and it's like back to school right in my face. I'm just like, it's not even September yet. So, um, screw them and they're back to school. <laughs> but when I, um, when I think about back to school, I usually think about hairstyles for back to school because no one said you can't look pretty for back to school. So, today I'll be showing you guys a few simple, um, hair styles you can do in less than like five ten minutes and it some of them are like three four minutes three four seconds okay so there is no excuse for not having your hair done properly yes and um so i hope you enjoy and i'll see you guys at the end of the video okay so for the first few hairstyles we will be using body pins so before i start i want to introduce you guys two body pins and it is tight body pin and loose body pin okay um i just made them up <laughs> so don't go to the store and just say do you have any tight body pins they'll be like what okay so um yeah so for the first hairstyle we will be using a loose body pin and this takes like less than two seconds seriously so first of all do this okay looks so ugly i know <laughs> but then you move it down and there you go it keeps your hair out of your face and so you can concentrate and you can put another one there it depends how much hair you have in the front but yeah okay and so the next hairstyle is not like that obviously it's use a bobby pin and pin it to the side so i will be using um what's this bobby pin called tight bobby pin right and i will i will be just bobby pinning it behind my ears this takes like what three seconds four seconds so easy and it keeps your hair out of your ear, so if you have like a cute earring or whatever, and you want to show it off, just do this, and it looks nice. And you may think, wow, this looks so weird. So if you think it looks weird, you can do it on the other side as well. And um, all you need to do is separate your bangs and the back of your hair. Then use a tight body pin. Then... That's a win. I use two most of the times. You can use one. Doesn't really matter. Like that. And if you don't like this, you don't like it on both sides, or you just like it on one side, not the other side, you can just adjust it to wherever, whatever type you want. And for the back, it's really nice. It's, it's like you, you didn't do anything at all. <laughs> and um, yeah, I really like this hairstyle. It takes less than four seconds. So the next hairstyle, I'm sure all of you guys know, it. Um, it's super simple. If you know it, just please skip it to the next one. Um, it's basically putting your hair back. So first you just twist it, put it down, take a bobby pin, and then pin it. Like that. And this is great if you're in gym class or... I just don't want any hair in your face, and most of the times I do this because a lot of um, hair equals a lot of dirt, equals a lot of oil, equals a lot of pimples. Yeah. So for the fourth hairstyle, it's basically creating the lump on your head. I'm sure most of you guys know about it. And it's really simple. To, you take the hair on the crown of your head, and don't take too much. Just take the this part, the one you want a lump on, and then just tease it. And teasing it will give your hair more volume. And then take more hair at the back, and then just... Twist it, and then pin it down, and use another bobby pin if you have a lot of hair, and secure it again, like that. And if you want this bump to be bigger, you can take um, the rest of your comb and just move it like so. Of course, some of you guys might want to spice this hairstyle up a bit, and um, you can just try a ponytail on the back or on the side. So I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna tie it. Let's just tie it a little bit on the side. Like so. And you finish it off with some hairspray, and I think you're good to go. Because I think that this hairstyle is very mature, it's great for presentations, and it's very work-slash-school appropriate. Because the hair's, okay, most of the hair's out of your face, and it's really cool and refreshing. Okay, so now we're done with hair, um, bobby pins. I was gonna say hair pins, but, um, bobby pins. Let's move on to 
elastic bands, hair ties, and scrunchies. Okay, so of course, we all know the typical, um, what's called ponytail. And, and I think it's really boring sometimes. So I'm gonna teach you guys a way to spice up your ponytail. So first, you wanna take, um, actually I'm gonna use different, I'm gonna use a scrunchie. Or, I'm gonna use a hair tie actually. And, I'm just gonna tie it like so. Okay? And then, pull it down a bit. And then open this part. And then poke my hair can through it. Oh, I hate doing this part. And try to grab your hair. And pull it through like so. Then, like that. So I think this kind of hairstyle with a twisted, kind of inverted ponytail is very unique. Because it's just like, how'd you do that? <laughs> but now you know how to do it. So next hairstyle, of course, if you can't tell, is the half ponytail. And this is really easy to do. It takes like three seconds. Take this part of your hair and just tie it up. That's all. But this is so boring and it looks so plain. So what you can do is substitute this elastic band for a cute barrette. And it'll look so much better. And if you're those, if you're like a sweet and innocent kind of girl, it's great for you. Even if you're not, if you're trying to be, if you're trying to be like a teacher's pet, get more marks. Yeah, I think this will work too. <laughs> okay, this is a better view of the hairstyle, and this is for those people who want to be dramatic and different, in a good way. And it's always good, you know. And there you go. Actually, there was this one person who I was at the supermarket who asked me how to do this, so. Girl at the supermarket, now you know, if you're watching this. <laughs> um, yeah, I hope she's watching this, because I explained it to her, and then she's just like, the retail are you talking about? So, it's not my fault. We've covered smart, cute, uh, innocent, and sweet, punk rock, cool. Next on our agenda is cute. Okay, so how are we going to make a cute hairstyle? Simple. You're going to take a little bit of hair, not, not a little bit, just like, like um, two or three inches of your hair. And then take... An elastic, like so, and then instead of tying it at the back, you're gonna tie it on the side. Ooh. Like that, and then you want to make it on the side, like this. And I see a lot of people on Blackie, a lot of girls on Blackie, which is a Taiwanese um, variety show. Um, they do this and they're like what, 30 20 something they're 20 something and when they have this they look like they're 18 16 17 so yeah <laughs> and if um that kind of hairstyle isn't your style you can do another way and basically it's like a bobby the bobby pin one except you're using a hair tie or elastic and basically you're going to tie it on the side like so I don't know. I don't recommend doing the other side or else you're going to look like you're five or six, but um, you don't have to do it on this side. You can just do it on the other side, like here, and you can have this part down. It's up to you. I like to have this one up and this one, this part down, but that's just me. It's really up to you. And this look was actually inspired by, um, it started with a kiss, this um, Asian drama a long time ago, and Errol Lynn had this hairstyle. It wasn't me and Errol Lynn, okay? So I hope you guys enjoyed it. They're really quick. They're just some kind of, some um, styles that I just came up with. Some of them might be once you know, so um, leave a comment if you like it, if you hate it, whatever. <laughs> and um, I will be cutting my hair soon, by the way, so once I cut my hair and if I think of any hairstyles, I'll put up a video on um, back to school hairstyle for shortish hair. I think I'm going to cut it like this short, maybe. I'll see. And... Um, yeah, I hope you liked it, and please rate, no, like, ugh, just get that mistake, like, comment, and subscribe.